Brent Havland and we're here at the Cooper's Cave Brew Pub and I just want to tell you guys about the rooftop garden we're instituting this year to bring fresher, better produce to our customers. Oh, that's fabulous. So this will be the first year you're going to have a rooftop garden? Yes. Right here at Cooper's Cave Pub? Absolutely. Oh, fabulous. Go. Let's go take a look. Okay. These are my cherry tomatoes, biggest tomato plant I've ever seen in my life. They are large. These are my Cherokee purples and my grape tomatoes. Cherokee purple? Yeah. And grape tomatoes. And grape tomatoes and over there are my uh, pink, pink brandy wines. Now, when did you plant these? It was uh, around June 10th. So June 10th to now, they've gotten this big? Yes. And they were just, you know, the small seedlings. This is just the start of uh, what's going to be um, a food supply for Cooper's Cave uh, Pub, right? Yeah. And I've always wanted to, you know, cook in various places kind of have a garden because you know the less it's going to travel the better it's going to be you know a tomato that picked was picked an hour ago is invariably better than a tomato that was picked last week in california and brought in a truck and yeah sitting in a box for a while yeah well there's no doubt so you're talking about tomatoes from here going straight yeah. downstairs straight downstairs the customers then will be happy yeah they'll notice the difference oh absolutely Plus their heirloom, you know, you can't even buy this stuff. Oh, heirloom tomatoes, great. Well, I see a lot of other um, space here on this roof. Yes. Do you see this actually expanding actually and covering the rest see, of this? Well, I would see it going down this side. Because actually, this fall, solar hot water and power is going in over here. Right. Really? Yes. So you're going to actually power the hot water system, solar energy, right here on the roof? Yes. Because right now all it's doing is heating the roof. And heating and the heating, town. And he, right. <laughs> Might as well capture that. Yeah. So you're going to have solar-powered tomatoes and solar-powered hot water. Yes, exactly. Right here on the roof at Cooper's Cave in Glens Falls. Yes. Now, is this the first uh, rooftop garden that you know of in Glens Falls? I believe it is. Unless there might be people who, you know, have an apartment. But as far as a business as far goes, as right? Business. Restaurant. Yeah. Kind of a fair. I'm actually fairly sure it is. I mean, I, you know been in the restaurant business here in town forever and I know everybody right that's fantastic so cutting edge here at Cooper's Cave yeah it's kind of like uh, going back actually yeah because people very, used to do this all the cool. time exactly so if the truck doesn't come Cooper's Cave will still have a good salad right <laughs> yeah that looks awesome basil Basil, yeah. There's a pepper, look at that. I could be at someone's salad. And these are zucchinis here. Yeah, well zucchini and yellow squash. Wonderful. So what's on the menu tonight? Um tonight's actually Mexican night. Every Tuesday's Mexican night. And you'll be putting in some well, our squash is going to be just the veg du jour, uh -huh. and you know everything. Our flat, fresh uh, coriander, and cilantro. Oh, right sure. There is pretty much in all of the Mexican dishes. So as this expands, you'll be able to incorporate more um, of your homegrown vegetables right yes, into the menu. More variety. That's excellent. Well, thanks very much. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you very much. Those are our freshly picked squash from the rooftop garden, which are going to be our vegetable du jour for the first time this evening. Fantastic, and this is the first meal actually produced by the rooftop garden today. Yes, it is. Can't wait to try it. Me too. <laughs>